everybody. This one is going to be a very quick video to help you understand how you can clean your brass, bronze or copper, copper probably in the comfort of your home without having to refill the piece. Metal, as in when it comes into contact with the elements, tends to discolor, tarnish, gather dust and grime. While it is perfectly acceptable for you to want to embrace the patina of the piece as it grows organically, you might want to restore it back to its original colors. In which case, a few basic steps need to be followed and this can be done in the comfort of your home. Let me show you how. For the purpose of this demonstration, we are going to work with this old bronze Prabhavali. It frames a beautiful Tanjore style Durga artwork. Although the metal is not quite as tarnished here, I am going to be using this frame just to illustrate the process to you. To begin with, cover the work surface with your scrap cloth. It helps to have a soft, cushioned and non-slip work surface. Clean the entire piece gently. I am using a real feather duster here. You can choose a soft cloth or a thick brush instead. Once the frame is nice and clean, we will cover the entire area of the fabric barring the metal surface with butter paper. Now using painter's tip, ensure that you tape down all of the butter paper. You might find that some of the fabric remains exposed in some places. You can use the painter's tip to secure these areas as well. Once the entire frame and the fabric area is fully covered, we will proceed to cover the artwork as well. At no point during the process should your fingers come into contact with the surface of the artwork. I am using Brasso which is readily available here to clean the metal. To begin with, we give it a good shake. Wrap a soft cotton cloth around two of your fingers. Take out some of the Brasso onto the cotton and apply it all over the Prabhavali gently. Once you've applied the Brasso, start buffing the Prabhavali in soft circular motions. I like to work one section at a time. To access the hard to reach areas, you can use a Q-tip dipped in Brasso. Allow the product to sink in, in the crevices of the carving and tiny areas. And buff with the dry side of the Q-tip. Keep buffing the metal until you achieve the patina you really want. A little elbow grease does it. 
a small amount of product and gentle motions go a long way.